Well, one of my biggest concerns about the impact of the coronavirus over the last eight months has been the impact on our students, especially K through two students who are really learning the tools like reading that are gonna help them set, set up for success later in school. Uh, so I wanna see how Gentry Schools are handling it. it. It's been a remarkable success story here over the last month and a half. The students I saw today were all happy. They were all working diligently. Uh, the teachers and the administrators here uh, have worked very hard to set up an environment that is as much like normal as possible for the students, uh, keeping everyone healthy and safe, while also giving them the tools that they need. So it's been a great visit here, and I hope that the successes here are being replicated at schools all across the state. I think so far, so good. Obviously, some schools have had some instructional shifts for a few days, but by and large, most schools have been able to mitigate the risks through a combination of physical distancing and use of masks, good hygiene, maybe shifting instruction to outdoors environments, changing the way kids play and recess or take lessons like PE or music, changing the way they have breakfast and lunches. Obviously with the contagious virus, uh, about which we are still learning some of the properties, uh, it is going to spread some in our communities, uh, but so far, I think by and large, our schools are uh, holding up very well, uh, and it's really important because our kids need to be in school and they need to be learning in person with their teachers to the great extent possible.